What the hell is even this? I was sitting here today in my office just jerking off into a cup, and then I get a notification saying Gideon and Pokimane are eating in the same house? On the same couch? Possibly surrounded by a mouse? Pokimane in a sweater, not a blouse? Gideon might make her his spouse? Is that sauerkraut? Anyway, call me Owen Wilson, but wow, what a twist. What a turn of events. Just when you thought 2022 couldn't get any weirder, this happens. So if you guys have not caught yourself up with the Pokimane and Gideon debacle, check out this video on screen, link in the bio below. It summarizes the drama perfectly. Once you're caught up, come back to this video. But for all of you who are fully aware of the fuckery that has happened over the last month, let's talk about this photo, because this is incredible. Gideon and Pokimane are collabing, and I'm actually happy about this. My whole opinion regarding the drama originally was that these people make way too much money, and they should just grow a set of balls and settle the drama outside the internet off Twitter. Now despite the nonsensical arguments and the fan bases of these two getting wet ass pussies from the Twitter beef, it looks like Gideon and Pokey have settled the score and are putting the beef behind them and I'm pretty happy about that. I guess Pokimane saw Gideon's apology and maybe she reached out to him or maybe he reached out to her. I mean either way, they're on a couch, in the same house, slouched, Hopefully not in Laos because Laos is a communist country and commies are evil. I'm looking at you, China. According to Gideon, they filmed a Q&A together and it will be posted on his YouTube channel sometime in the near future. And to further solidify that this is actually happening, Gideon even confirmed it in an Instagram live. Oh, man. The fuck is happening right now? Did I phase rug y'all? Was this whole situation just for publicity? But guess what? All your answers... Are gonna be answered. Oh no! All your questions are gonna be answered in like three to five weeks. I don't know. It's gonna take me a minute to post the video, but um, like like bro, I like in the apology video I made on my second channel, y'all told you guys I don't like beef. Like I'm a chill dude. Like I don't know. That's all I gotta say. But um, just wanted to say real quick, you know. Oh, for y'all wondering, she's not here. I'm, I'm by myself right now. I'm by myself, so it's just me. It's just me. But first thing first, I guess the only thing I would want to say, bro, is if you guys have a disagreement with a person, it can always be mended. That's all I'm going to say right now. It can always be mended. And to further prove that this is happening and that the beef between Pokimane and Gideon is over, Pokimane tweeted the iconic Gideon phrase, it's bigger than black and white. Which if you guys don't know, Gideon kept posting that lyric on Twitter back when the whole fiasco was taking place. The lyric is from The Bigger Picture by Lil Baby. Yeah, I'm hip with the fucking kids, I know what's up. I'm not entirely sure if this is going to be their only collaboration or if there's more in store for us. I also wonder if now that the beef is squashed, if Pokimane is interested in reaching out to Twitch representatives to help Gideon get unbanned, I'd like to imagine that Gideon and Pokemon just apologize to each other for their own faults and are now going to be friends going forward. I mean, I'm just happy that this beef is over because the beef, in my personal opinion, was just so stupid. But I do have a question. What's gonna happen between Pokimane and Ninja? Because if you guys don't remember, Ninja got himself involved in this drama and Pokey got pretty pissed off at Ninja. Are they also going to work things out behind the scenes or is the beef going to continue? I mean, I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm, I'm curious. I'm just as curious as you people. I'm not a doctor. I'm not a gynecologist. I'm, I'm just a man. All right, leave me alone. Please put the gun away. Again, I'm pretty happy that this beef is over because I thought it was stupid, but like, bro, what the hell happened today? Like first, GTA 6 was confirmed today, completely out of the blue. And now these two are eating burgers together. God, 2022 is weird. Anywho, if you guys enjoyed today's video, do me a favor, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, follow me on all of my social links, and join my Zesty Flaming Hot Discord server. Links are in the description below. Have a great day, everyone. And remember that all beef can be squashed, unless you're a vegan.